Hi, I'm Christine Bomberger, inpatient music therapist at Cleveland Clinic Children's. The last six months have been quite a whirlwind for us music and art therapists at Cleveland Clinic Children's, but we have certainly pushed through. Uh, when the pandemic first hit, we were actually sent to work from home, and this was really hard for us because we knew that the patients really needed the extra support during this crazy time of uncertainty and such an unprecedented time. Um, but we put our heads together, figured out new ways to reach our patients and the staff at the hospital. One way in which we were able to help from home was creating um, virtual content. So this included um, music videos, relaxation tracks, and even video streams featuring art therapy interventions. So, but this meant we had to familiarize ourselves with new technology. Um, another example of that new technology is here you'll see Meredith, our inpatient art therapist, working with a 3D printer. 3D printing has been a great way to connect with patients who would otherwise be reluctant to engage in art therapy. They're able to create and print their own sculptures, print their favorite video game characters, and so much more. Many patients choose to paint their completed prints. We're also learning how to scan and create unique 3D printed portraits of patients and their families to, to create keepsake mementos and celebrate milestones in their treatment. So as Cleveland Clinic Children's began offering more options for virtual appointments, um, the art and music therapists, we jumped on that bandwagon as well. Um, but these virtual sessions certainly looked really different. Um, but our patients who just remained resilient as ever were actually pretty excited to try it out. Staff were able to drop off materials and these materials actually the patients could keep once the session was done. Despite still being able to connect with our patients virtually, it just didn't feel the same. That therapeutic value of being present and supporting these kids in their own space, it was taken away. So finally, after about a month and a half, we were able to return to the bedside. Ms. Thompson, a caregiver of a young patient who participated in a virtual session, had this to say about music and art therapy returning. Having the therapist as a part of our stay is critical. It is a chance to see my child find joy in the stay. It is one of the few things he asks to receive. As a family, we need this outlet to see our child have some joy and the ability to channel his feelings into something outside of medical related needs. He has this joy on his face that changes the mood in the room. Sometimes he has to dig deep to have energy to participate and this is his choice for the staff to provide the services despite how he is feeling. These services are needed and should never go away. They bring life, joy, and fun into a hospital room, not only for the child, but for the adults as well. Seeing your child enjoying activities and interacting with a the therapist puts a smile on the parents' hearts and is priceless. I want to share that the staff are a part of the children's circle of friends. They all talk about seeing them and what they did when they came. From time to time, our child has asked when he goes through a tough procedure if his reward could be having the art or music therapist come by his room afterwards so he can share with them how brave he was. Finally, I want you to know after my child's transplant, he was quiet and extremely tired. He would open his eyes for us to let us know he was aware and then close them again. However, when the music therapist came by the room and he heard her voice, he smiled for the first time and reached his hand out to her to let her know he was happy that she came by to see him. Our family greatly appreciates these services and the kindness of the staff providing them. Though these last six months gave us the opportunity to refine our skills and our tools, we are just so thrilled to be back at the bedside. The support we received from SAMS fans helps makes this possible. So from all of us at Cleveland Clinic Children's, thank you.